I will go over the Cataclysm encounter, the first encounter of the Root of Nightmares raid in this short guide. So first off, to orient you to this guide, it, when you first spawn into the room, if you look to your right, I look at that as the front of the room. That meaning then where you spawn in is right and the other side is left. So what you're going to do is you're going to divide up into one group that's ad clear. That group should be either four or five players. Then one or two people that I'll call the Light Bearers that are going to take a buff a field of light and basically traverse a path through this encounter. You will have a number of ads for the ad clear team. You also have tormentors and barriers. So keep that in mind when you think about what you want to take into this encounter. For the light bearers, it doesn't really matter. You may want to put something like a wither horde or gallant horn that you can every once in a while help the fire team with damage, but you're going to want good mobility. And if you're on a hunter stompies or anything, allow you to jump around the room really quickly. So for the light bearer, they're going to shoot the initial orb that's, that you get into when you first get in the room and get a buff that's called Field of Light, and the rest of the folks will fan out. Again, spawning between the left and the right sides of the room to kind of get coverage for all the ads. The Light Bearer and the Ad Clear team are going to look for two signs. I will put a map up here real quickly that shows, and again, credit to the Raid Secrets team for putting this together, but shows some of the locations that you can find within this raid as far as locations with science. These are signs that are very similar to when you did the Leviathan raid where you'd have to punch them to advance in the counter. So you punch two of those. Once you do that, the Light Bearer is going to see another orb that's going to be lit up brightly. They're going to have to then go to that orb and basically connect it and they're going to continue to do this throughout the encounter as that's happening you're going to have a tormentor show up on one side of the room and you're going to have a barrier champion show up on the other when this is in contest mode or in master and things like that you're going to have everyone the ad clear team to consolidate and basically take that tormentor out you'll notice that you have a debuff that has a counter on it when that debuff runs out you die the only way you advance that counter is to actually go and kill the tormentor so that's the important thing don't worry about the barrier yet get that first now once the light bearer actually goes in and completes that first path that first path through the thing it'll actually it'll actually stop that debuff. So you can extend it obviously by continuing to kill Tormentors and things like that and to kill Scions. If you get that, you'll actually get a, like a rest period, a period where the buff will not continue to happen. At that point, just slay out and kill as many ads as possible because you'll need to do that because you'll have to continue going through the cycle. And again, the cycle is kill the two Scions, get the Tormentor to spawn, kill the Tormentor, kill all the ads. And again, that's what you need to continue to do to continue to not wipe. While you're doing that, the Light Bearer is just going to continue to go in and advance the path until it gets to the end of the room. One thing to keep in mind is that the Scions and will continue to advance in the Tormentors towards the back of the room. As you get towards the back of the room, they'll actually have the Tormentors in a specific place. Again, I'll reference this map where you can see that. But the other thing is some of the Scion locations may happen behind you. So that's something to keep in mind. So continue to do that. Advance to the very end. And then you, you'll basically, from these mechanics, learn what you need to take into the next encounter, the Secision, which is the second encounter within the Root of Nightmare raid. That's the video. If you like it, feel free to like my video, subscribe to my channel, jump my Discord, and I'll see you guardians in the tower.